Oh, sorry. another part of the farm there's no cows right here but it's just pretty okay I'm not fully dressed to go in the snow I'm just going for a second but there is this thing that we do that I've done since I was a little kid that I just assumed was something that everybody did with snow it's coming in on me and that is making snow cream okay you get a cup and you get a bowl, preferably a, a milk replacer cup, that works. And you get snow and you mix it with sugar and milk. Some people use condensed milk. I just use milk and a little vanilla and you've got snow cream. Okay, it's delicious. If you've never done this, I beg you to try it. I mean, some people say they're afraid to eat snow because it might be dirty. I mean, I just stay away from the yellow snow. Wait, wait. And that was so stupid. I can't believe I just did that. But anyway, stay away from the yellow snow. And you could, like, take off a layer of the top snow if you felt better about it. So, that's what I do. It is really snowing. Like, it's coming down a lot. Well, I do. Bonnie! This is not for you. This is for us. I'm just coming to my picnic table. I don't see any like cedar tree particles or anything. The dogs have not been up here. <laughs> so it should be fine. Should be. And you just, I don't know, I just get a bunch. And we will do this probably five or six times before it's all said and done. My kid's been begging all morning. So, this is lunch. Snow cream lunch. All right. I just put some snow in a bowl. In another bowl because it's too much to deal with. And... Per usual for me, I don't measure anything. You just keep adding till it's the right consistency and it's sweet enough. <laughs> it's not hard. Yeah, it makes you fly the Sugar. Uh, I don't know. You can always add more snow if you put too much sugar. I add a little bit of vanilla just because I want to. Alright, let's see. Actually, I think I usually use a whisk, but I think this is going to do fine. last year when I posted this on Twitter how many people that live in snow regions whoops like snowy regions of the world um, had said they never heard of it and never done it 
makes me sad. I just feel like the whole world should know about this and it should be a part of their life. All right. Let's see what we got. on the head pretty good. Yeah. That, that like it's perfect. Okay, so there you go. Snow cream. Try it. Let me know what you think. So the kids are going out to play. What you got on your what you got <laughs> what you got on your pants, baby? Um uh duct tape. Duct tape. Oh, oh wait, I got it. Okay. Orange reflective duct tape. Which is gonna do what? Keep snow from getting in. Keep the snow from getting in. No, sir. A kid is throwing snowballs at my new door. No. That's not cool. We're not doing that. Yeah, Thank you, though. Ah! Where the puppy? No, I, no, don't hit me. I was just coming out for a second. Y'all, y'all throw them at each other. There's some puppies. Don't hit her in the face. All right. Yeah, it's not really packed now. Is now it packing good stays. now? Earlier, it wouldn't pack Look good. At <laughs> it's still snowing it just it won't stop i don't know y'all this is a lot of snow um yep got a nice dusting on the porch it just blows in blew my garland down oh look y'all do you like that i had to buy that sign when i saw it <laughs> You like it, Bonnie? Sugar, you're not going to stay dry at all if you lay on the ground. Stop, Wesley! Yeah, here we go. Fun times. I need to go feed Papa supper. But I don't feel like putting on all the layers. It's still snowing, y'all. It's still snowing. So I have my brain because my truck... My truck needs to be cleaned off before I can attempt to open the door and drive it. So let's we'll see how that goes. I bet the door doesn't open and looks frozen. My door opened. Is there a way to flip video? Wow, so that's a good look, right? Um. All right, truck started. Windshield's working. Windshield wipers. I only have to go a half a mile. But it's getting dark. And I didn't think to come out and crank this sucker up. I think my husband's out on the tractor somewhere. He's not answering my text. So, I'm just going to go. If I don't hear, I go. So, we'll see. <laughs> Thank goodness for four-wheel drive. That works. I don't know. I can't see anything. I know what's behind me. Mm -hmm. whoop, whoop. I love having four wheel drive. I don't know how people, well, whatever. I guess people live without four wheel drive that don't need four wheel drive, but. I tend to need it a lot. And if I get stuck, I'm definitely not going to show this on the vlog. <laughs> I'm sliding. This is one of those like 
18 point turns to get out of the drive. All right, y'all, where's the money? Oh, I can't see. Can't see. There's a foot of snow on the hood. And I didn't get it all down. Because I wasn't thinking about it being so high to have to look at over. I'm in trouble. All right. Okay, I cleaned it off. Whoa, y'all, look at this. It is up to my calf. That, I don't know if I've ever seen this much snow. Snow that wasn't like in the mountains. All right, I can see now. Let's try this again. Yeah. <laughs> That's on my truck. Clean? Not clean. All right. Uh, got to stay on the road. follow this to the house. <laughs> My husband is scraping the road, which is nice. Too bad it wasn't scraped before I had to leave the first time. Yeah. It works though. True story, y'all. I hope you can hear me. I'm going to figure out a way to get a speaker. Oh, what? Microphone. Anyway, True story, I sat on my tail on the couch and watched two movies this afternoon. Elf with the kids and then It's a Wonderful Life. Because I used to watch It's a Wonderful Life every year with my mom. That was like our thing that we did and I miss that. So, I did it and it was amazing to sit still for that long and just veg out and watch a movie highly recommended huh. and now you would think since I'm like cooped up inside I would be like cooking all the things I'm not and I don't even feel like it I'm making some slaw to go with leftover beef barbecue I was gonna make cornbread but I don't feel like doing that either so I guess my family's just gonna suffer tonight my girl's eating canned soup and you know what they're gonna survive they're going to survive. Maybe I'll make cornbread tomorrow. I kind of want to vlog that. We'll see how that goes. Anyway, I think that's going to wrap it up for this first part of Snowmageddon. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Maybe we can actually do some sledding. Or the kids. Not mama. I mean, maybe. We'll see.